Hey, you're new? Yeah. Name? Danny Kelly, year 11. Right, Kelly, year 11's down the hall on the left. March! And fix that tie. Okay, let's make a start. Can you open your textbooks, please, to chapter 7? War, Europe and the Pacific. It's on page 215. Oh, the new recruit. Kelly. Uh-huh. Oh, glad you found us, son. Please take a seat. And it's Aha, sir. Okay. Jus ad bellum. It's a phrase you might have heard on the news. Jus ad bellum. Anyone? Taylor. Don't watch the news, sir. What's the brain? What's the brain? Oh. Those who ignore the lessons of history are condemned, condemned to, to repeat, repeat them. them. Well said. Well, how about you, Kelly? Were you familiar with Jus ad bellum from your previous school? We didn't have Italian, so. Okay, thank you. It's Latin for a just war, sir. Yes, Tran. It's the legal theory behind a just war. What conditions are required Thanks. to declare a war? Jus said that one. Gilbert's a bit of a dick, but he's okay. What's Torma like? Mr. Torma, tend to keep out of his way. It's fine for you, you're a jock. I'm supposed to meet him. They'll know where he is. Thanks. Hey, Taylor. I'm Danny Kelly. You guys are the swim team, yeah? Yeah. Why? He's the newbie. Oh. Martin Taylor. <laughs> I saw you win the under 16s in Geelong. Crushed it, man. Thanks. So, what do you swim, Dino? 100 free. Ah, like him. And him. <laughs> and me. And me. That'd be your shit. <laughs> <laughs> you guys know what Tomer is? I should probably tell him I'm here. Swim center. Where else? <laughs> <laughs> so, then how do you think that the war would have influenced the art of poets and musicians? Don't ask Dino, sir. He only knows about. <laughs> okay, okay, thank you, thank you. Anyone else? Titsis? Titsis. Titsis knows. Titsis knows, exactly. Absolutely. I honestly don't. <laughs> Shh, Tom. You need to see Danny Kelly? Hello to you too, Mr. Tom. Okay, go on up you get, almighty sport beckons. Not you boys, you stay where you are, see you later. Just this one. Thank you, Mr. Gilbert. Here it is. Use your words, Kelly. Unbelievable. I had the whole thing redesigned. It's the same pool Daniel Kowalski swims in. Sound good? Yeah, Mr. Toma. Yes, coach. Yes, coach. And now we've been the top swimming school for over 100 years. Schoolboy champions, state champions, record holders. This is where the best come to swim. You think you can be part of that? Yes, coach. Yeah? We're gonna see. Go and get changed and get in the water. <laughs> Not bad. Come on out, please. Stand over here. I want to show you something. And when you're lifting your arm up in the water, I want you to come up from here, from back, from your shoulders, so up. Yeah, like this. Hard for me because of injury, but from here. We create one lever. All right? Your hand, your wrist, and your forearm. Okay, so from here, soft hands and pull through. Again. That's it. From the back. Good boy. Hey, where you been? Sorry, sir. We got held back. You're bullshit, Wilco. It's true. Mr. Gilbert wouldn't let us go. Okay, hang up. Okay, listen to me. Try that back in there. All right, from here, up. Nice 
Paris favours, Dino. Love the colour. Cool, I might get some myself. <laughs> Did your mum get them at Target? <laughs> well, you're yeah, we're all having a joke, huh? <laughs> Everyone telling jokes. We're telling jokes. Good luck. You want to hear a joke? I got one. Last year, we lost the 4 by 100 relay at the school championships in Albany. But I know that you know this because you are the only team in the history of this school to achieve such a feat. The only team to lose the relay. <laughs> Why are you not laughing? Hmm? How does this make you feel? Like shit? Well, it should. Now stop fucking around and get on the blocks. And to add to this, you had the under-16 freestyle champion leading you off. And you still couldn't win. So we are not going to lose at Aubrey in the relay again, are we? No, no coach. coach. Are we? No, no coach. coach. So you've got to notice, i got five of you on the blocks. And how many does it take for a relay success? Four, coach. Four. So who's going to be? Who's going to step up over the next three weeks and demand to be in this team? Who's going to win us back the gold at Aubrey? Because make no mistake, this is not a fucking game. You want to play a game, you go onto the field and you play the Aussie rules. This swimming. Okay. 200 max effort on my mark. Set. Kelly, second place. Very close. Okay. And then better, better. Scooter. You're not kicking. You forget to kick to that? No. I need you to kick. Okay? And you? I give you $500. You don't look at yourself in the mirror today. <laughs> You swam well as well, Martin. Yes. Yeah. Kelly, he almost beat you. Look at me. You have been coasting, son. Yes, coach. Yes. I'm going to tell you something. You need to buckle down on that kid. He's going to eat you alive. Tootsies, what are you doing? Get out of the shower. You like the pool? It's awesome. Must be nice for someone like you not to have to dodge all the band-aids and condoms and shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, man. Didn't see you there. <laughs> Why do you take it, huh? What? They laugh at you. Why? Because you walk. I'm walk. Doesn't bother me. Bullshit. You can't bullshit to me. You always answer back after an insult, son. An insult is an attack. Okay. And I'm going to tell you something I want you to listen. These boys here, they're not your mates. You're a threat to them. Give it back. And you almost beat the state champion today. Do you know what that means? It means you're not here just to make up the numbers. It means you can be the best. Well, if I can see that, those boys can see it too. Go. Can I get you a glass of water? Uh, yeah, thanks. Hey, Phil. Hey. You done your words? No, it's too hard. Do my maths. Your words, Thea. You don't give up because something's hard. So, how was your first day? Mm. Fine. Get off! What? I want my own desk. I know, buddy. I know. So, how was it? Good. Then bad. Then good again. 
What do you mean? Well, the tournament's amazing. He had just one small correction on my stroke and I swam like a second faster. Wow. I need to get the school swimmers. That's why he won five national totals. And he thinks I can be top in the squad. Really? Yeah. I knew that. Look at my boy. Hey, Dad. Wow. I thought you weren't coming back this week. Well, made up time. So this is a famous uniform. No, I'll leave it on. I want the full experience. Come on, Dad. Come on, give us a twelve. <laughs> not a chance. Doesn't a man get to see what his money's paying for? You're not paying a cent of it. You want a scholarship. You yeah, didn't pay for a new uniform, though, did you? Oh, you wanted him to send out? So what's this fancy school like, mate? It's fine. Been overwhelmed by the level of detail. It's a school, Dad. Well, come on. Tell us about the pool. Oh, it's incredible. Yeah? Yeah. I came second to Martin Taylor. State champion. Yeah. Oh, Martin Taylor. State champion, eh? Not for much longer, eh, son? Hey, Dave. Looks really fancy, his private school uniform. Yeah. He's one of them now. Sorry about that. <laughs> so, how is it? It's cool. Mm. It's got all these rules, like, just to march everywhere, like you're in the army. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh my god. No one even calls you by your first name. It's just, Kelly, do this, Kelly, do that. God, I hate it. So, why go there? No, it'll make me a better swimmer. Chuck's parties on Friday. Well, you can't train at night time, psycho. I have to train Saturday mornings. Chuck asked me to ask you. He wants you to come. I want you to come. Don't you want to come? Coach said he'll make me a champion. Yeah. A boring, lonely champion. I don't care. I'm going to be the best. <laughs> I'm gonna be the best. <laughs> we had a great time in part two. I didn't find it as uptight as I thought it was going to be. My kids love those ski fields. Morning. Hi. Hi, I'm Stephanie. Kelly. I'm Daniel Kelly's mum. Oh, he's a scholarship boy. Hi, Samantha. Hi. Hi, I'm Daddy. Hi, I'm Pat. And, um, uh, who's your boy? Uh, Pop Martin, lane two. Martin, Martin Taylor. Beautiful swimmer. Danny and I, we couldn't keep our eyes off him at the state finals. You're at the finals? Yes, as spectators only. Oh, yeah. Thank you. I thought it was, um, it was a good me. Oh, God, I thought it was atrociously organised. Because oh, I woke up up with the shuffle bus. We almost missed the heat. I'm so glad you said that. It, yes. Anyway, I had a word to them. I think it'll be better next year. Yeah. How long has Martin been swimming? Competitively, since through 10. Danny's been swimming since he was seven. All he thinks or talks about. Coach Toma said um, most swimmers, if they aren't champions by the age of 12, never will be. He likes that quote. Oh. Don't take it to heart. I believe in my son. Too many early mornings not to, hey? 
Yes. Ah, oh, Domi. Now say a clock, ladies. Okay, me. Mm. Sorry. <laughs> That's all right. Great coffee, Domi. Very good, boys. Good time. Hey, Taylor, check out Dino's mum. <laughs> She's a babe. Kelly, your mum has nice legs. <laughs> All right, very good set. Well done, boys. One more. Suck. What did you say? Nothing. Nothing. Tell me what you said. Suck up. Because he wants to do one more. Okay, we're not going to do one more. We're going to do ten more. And you can thank the scooter. Oh, Line up. <laughs> hey Dino, was that your mum this morning? Was she on TV? She's a hairdresser. Someone's got to cut hair. Oh, <laughs> that's nice. She's cool, man. Almost definitely. No, you're lucky, man. Your mum's hot. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was just messing with you. <laughs> you <can do> <laughs> Kelly, why are you crying? Your mum's got great tits. <laughs> You're funny idiots. Didn't think you were allowed to use this as a scooter. What did you say? <laughs> What's going on? Accident, sir. I bet. Trent, you okay? Yeah. Kelly, hit me, sir. Titsis, take Trent to the infirmary. No, I will, sir. No. You straight to detention. But, sir, we don't tolerate thugs at this school, Kelly. <coughs> now, the rest of you get changed for next period. Yeah, fucking shots. <laughs> <laughs> Idiot. Fucking train. Come on, boys, 25 seconds to go. Keep going. Coach. I can't train today. Well, don't know how it worked at your other school, but unless you have broken your arm, then you can swim. I got detention. I hate Scooter. You can't swim, you can't be on the team. Hey, I was just defending myself. Scooter's been at me since I got here. Hey, you said give it back. And this is what you think I meant, to hit someone? Hmm? Go back to class. You're off the team. Come on, let's go. Keep going. Fuck off, Luke. Daddy! You could get expelled. Daddy! Oh, wow. Oi! What the hell's he doing here? <laughs> if it isn't Mr. Private School Boy. Yeah, yeah. What's up your ass? I'll go out and keep you out. Oh, hi, man. Hey, Good seeing you, man. Give oh, me some classic night. Oh, yeah. Spaz was so wasted. It was so funny. Oh, yeah. Let's go. See you. Be up for diet. Yep. Hey, don't you have that school's championship in about, like, now? Do you want to tell me about it? No. I did beat the shit out of someone, though. You. The show's got pussies, eh, huh? Man, I could beat you up. Oi, I love you, faggot. Don't be a dumbass, OK? is putting a lot of pressure on him. You and I, we can't understand the level of... 
focus that, that, that he needs. There's not much focus in fighting at school. Going to that school is a very special opportunity and I'm going to do everything I can to support him. He's going to be one of the greats. He's going to be a champion. And what if... What if what, love? You know what I'm going to say. I want him to win too, but what if he's not good enough? What if he doesn't like it? What then? I need to see Jalen Wilkinson. Training, sir. Thanks. I'm sorry, coach. Yeah, well, too late for that. I'm faster than that. You want to win at Aubrey, right? You're not going to win without me. Is that right? Yeah. And you're faster than them? Yeah. Okay. Come with me. Okay, boys, take a break. Danny's here because he thinks he should be in the team instead of one of you. He says to me he is faster. Who are you faster than? You know. I'll tell you what I know. I know I have a group of men here busting a gut, and I have a boy here with a big mouth. So, who are you faster than? Because if you're right, I have to cut one of these men. Who is it? Titsus. Titsus. Are you sure? Yeah. Yeah? Do you have your costume? Yeah. Yeah? So just grab your goggles, the rest of you sit down, you're going to swim. Gutless. What are you waiting for? Jeans. You serious? You're not wearing those filthy jeans to Tom's house. But have you seen them? I left something out for you on your bed. Danny! Listen. This is a very important night, okay? So please promise me you will listen to what he has to say. Okay. Okay. Then. Thomas said you could be the best. I think he's wrong. You are the best. Okay? Never forget that. Mr. Toma. Danny, you're early. Cool garden. I like it, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Come through to the left and put your back down. Is that your dad? You're cheeky, you know. <laughs> that is me before I left hungry. And that, that is my coach. You know, he used to eat us with a kind if he thought we were being lazy. You see, a coach, he recognizes potential. That's all we have. But there is something else that makes a champion beyond potential. Is he the boy who pushes to the front of the line? The boy who has to win. You know, Danny, I've never had an Olympian. I've come very close to him. You make me believe. I could be an Olympian. You 
won't be anything if you can't be part of this team. I was giving it back, like you said. You were doing exactly what they wanted you to do. You were stronger than them. You were faster than them. You must believe you deserve to be here. And then those boys, they will be begging you to swim with them. I promise. And that will be them. <laughs> Hello, boys. Come through, please. Nice it's good to see you. Hey, Wilco, we'll come on in, go straight through. It's the Three Stooges. <laughs> through here, come through for pizza, let's go. <laughs> He's a great guy. <laughs> you know, every year, I get Marika's pizzas from the team. And every year, the boy says the best they've ever eaten. <laughs> Eggplant on pizza. Who I thought? <laughs> okay, come on, now. So, who's going to win the 1500 at Atlanta Olympics? Perkins. Mm, KP's done. Seriously, Ellings has made the team. Maybe. But you've got to remember, we'll go, he's a champion. And what about you, Kelly? Who will win? Kowalski or Perkins? Perkins has been on top for a long time. But no one stays on top forever. Kowalski's gonna win. My man, Kelly! Mm. You're gonna have to wash your hands now. <laughs> hey! You're always fucking laughing and pointing and giggling like those, and I'm sick of it. All of you look at me and listen. There's one team here. Okay, not two teams, not ten, one. So all this squabbling bullshit between you all, it stops here tonight, do you understand me? Well, no one will be going to Albany. Is that what you want? Hmm? Is that what you want, Danny? No, coach. Is that what you want, Martin? No, coach. Right. And enough. Sorry for giving you so much shit recently. We've just known Sitsa since year seven, so it's hard having someone new come in. We cool? That's very well said, Martin. That's why I'm making you the team captain. I did. You understand what I said? Yes, coach. Okay. Okay, finish up. There's something I want to show you. <laughs> what is it? It's crapper. In Hungary, we call it palinka. Everyone stand up. Okay, there's no sipping. I right, just go straight down. Okay? One team. One team. Take a shake at three. Everybody take a seat. I'm going to read you something. It's about the swimmer. I want you all to listen. I wander all night in my vision, stepping with light feet, swiftly and noiselessly, stepping and stopping. I see a beautiful, gigantic swimmer swimming naked through the eddies of the sea. His brown hair lies close and even to his head. He strikes out with courageous arms. He urges himself with his legs. What are you doing, you red trickled waves? Will you kill the courageous giant? Will you kill him in his prime? For me, he writes about how the swimmer must become one with the water. his mind and find stillness. Complete silence. And only then will you swim your fastest. I want you to remember what we spoke of. One team. I got to sleep. I forget how he gets when the squad comes over. Scooter reckons it's because no one ever visits the lonely old bastard. Tom's not lonely. He's got us. Oh shit. Did I do that? What? <laughs> Those bruises? Shit. Doesn't hurt anymore. Fuck. Hey, how popular would I be if I cracked the rib of our best swimmer? I'm not the best swimmer. 
You are. Isn't that why Tormo brought you here? Because you're better than us. Don't worry about it. I'm cool with it. You're a great swimmer. Coach reckons I'm getting lazy. He reckons that I've got too comfortable. Well, I can help you. I'll push you a bit. What? <laughs> like, you'd help me get better? Yeah, for sure. On team? Yeah. Well, get off my bed, though. Sorry, dude. I said get your filthy wog feet off my mattress. You don't belong here, Kelly. And when I beat you in Aubrey, Tom was going to take your scholarship away and give it to another one of his monkeys. You'd help me. Fuck you. Hey. I told you to go to sleep. Okay, now go to sleep. Okay, coach. Hey, thanks for the pizzas. The minds and hearts of all Australians, the 1500 freestyle, hasn't been released for the next Australian swimming team. They came in this summer to open expectations. Oh, shit. Wilco gets electrolysis. Yeah. Oh, you get is your poor mum. Don't I need to do your back? My back? Yes! It's normal. Come on, Danny. Danny, honey. Get out! What is it, Debbie? The 1500 metre final starting. Okay, we'll be right there. Okay. Turn. Look at you, you're so beautiful. Beautiful. Really, the saviour of this Australian swimming team has been Daniel Kowalski. He is about to potentially become the first. We could get a nice free float and then bring it right to us. To win a medal in the 200, 400, and 500 free float. Shush. In your weekend state, could you please pull the blinds? South Africa. Thank you. Thank you. Don't shush your sister. She's so annoying. I'm annoying. Why don't you shut up? There he is, Kieran Perkins. The defending champion here in Atlanta, but what a story it has been. Yes, want He's only just He's incredible, though. He almost didn't make the team. He's, He's right, Mum. Perkins is the Aussie the golden boy. Is now tuned into this. What will Perkins have? Can Kowalski create history? 21 years of age. Come on, Kowalski. He's been representing Australia for a couple of years now, but this is his greatest moment. Come on, Dummy. Hold on. Come. Come on, forget the race. You're the fastest. This is your race. Yeah, good one. And away to a very fast start. Perkins in lane number eight has got away very quickly. You'll see a lot of whitewash almost sprinting in this first Don't let him get in front. Kowalski has gone with him. It's a surprise that both these boys are sprinting in the first 50 metres. Kowalski gets it on the wall, but Perkins in the lead after 75 metres still sprinting. The two are these first and second. Perkins at 150 with that lead. It's increasing now. It's probably one and a half body lengths. Daniel doesn't want to let Kieran get too far ahead. Daniel, he can still come back. He comes in with a cloud over him. Important for Kowalski to try and keep this gap. Do not let Perkins get too far ahead. He's sitting nice and high in the water, very different to what we saw in the heat. He leads by 15 metres. A real race for the silver medalist. Graham Smith from Great Britain comes up to challenge him and is actually moving away from Kowalski. He is fighting for the silver medal, Daniel Kowalski, but Kieran Perkins stands in solid Australia. A great Australian is swimming away from the field. About 15 metres to swim. Look at this great champion. Kieran Perkins will win the Olympic title. He will defend his crown. Look at Kowalski come for silver, but it's Perkins. It's all yes. Perkins into the final. Yes. 14, 56, yes. Yes. Kieran Perkins, what a champion, taking yeah. out the 1500, he defends this, the Australian team go wild, here is the great champion on deck, arms raised, silver, Kowalski takes the silver, oh he looks shattered, he looks disappointed, mm. Perkins didn't get gold, Kowalski lost it, Kowalski makes history, coming he beat himself, swimmer in Olympic history to win three medals in freestyle racing, the joy yeah. of Kieran Perkins, 14.56 wins the gold medal at the Olympic Games here in Atlanta, Daniel Kelly. I don't think there's too much pressure, but they know it's it's Samantha. 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 Don't. They're not your friends. They laugh at you behind your back. They call us wogs. Daddy! I gotta go. 
Good luck. What is it, Mum? Nothing, nothing. Great. Real fucking funny. Bad luck about Kowalski. You can't beat me. I thought I already did. The next event is the Open Boys 100 meter individual freestyle final. That's us, Dino. Alrighty. Come on, Taylor. You got this. Good swim, good swim. And listen, we're not finished yet, alright? We still got the relay to go, so I need you to concentrate, alright? Hey! Hey! You insulted my mother. You did everything you could to break me. Oh, fuck you. I won. I beat you. None of you will ever beat me again. Well, fuck you, real life. Hey. What'd you say to me? Go get him. Danny! Danny! You quitting? I've got two more gold. You don't even care about the relay. Fine. All right, you're right. We didn't want you here. And I thought that if we messed with you a little, you'd soak and you'd quit. I'm not swimming for you. Why? Whatever you wanted to prove, you proved it. I gave that race everything that I had and you still beat me. Do you know how that feels? We need you to win this, Kelly. Please. They're ready for us. In lane one, Water River secondary. In lane two, King Tank High School. In lane three, Queen's Road College. Simon Judd. Well done. Well 
Martin Taylor. Hold on, Martin. Quiet. Finally, Daniel Kelly. It was Daniel Kelly's heroic final lap that returned our under-18 boys freestyle relay title to the school. And for that, I also am personally grateful to head swimming coach Frank Connor. <laughs> Kelly also won the 100 metre individual freestyle, a superhuman effort. Well done. Well, Kelly swam like a barracuda. Thank you so much. If you want to represent your country, then you need us. You've never trained an Olympian. Until you learn some humility, it won't matter who you train it. You're not going to win the fucking team. We're actually talking about your future. My future's now, Mark. At the Sydney Olympics, I'll be 20. Yeah, you're damn idiot. You're yourself, Danny. You never heard. Stop all this fucking self-pity. Do you know what you've done? You've broken us. <laughs> 